that's what he is saying. He's saying that you basically imagine yourself in a roller coaster and then you have the steering wheel. That's what a Formula One is. Oh, having a steering wheel in your hands with all the buttons. Back in the day when my dad was in F1, when I was a little baby, basically, I sat in it and, you know, it's very cute, the pictures, but the very first time that I sat in the car and I was going to drive it myself, I was a little bit nervous. As Even a baby? I, to this day, sometimes when I do that, I get this, like, it shoots off. You have this, like, like, uh, kind of feeling. Yeah. I still have that in an F1 car sometimes. The stomach sinks. For these cars, since no two drivers are the same, no two Formula One cars are quite the same either, even for the same team. They have a, like a whole book of uh, measurements uh, from myself, from Max, so they know exactly my seat position, my pedal position, my sitting position. The seat is very important, it's a carbon seat. You're naturally in a very unnatural Everything position. Everything is carbon made, I guess. Got to sit in what I think was your seat in the RB19 in 